Hey guys, Kurt here with Teach Mom How. Today I am teaching mom all about Gmail labels on an iPhone. So you're going to learn how to keep your Gmail inbox clean and organized. If only I had Gmail labels for my real life, my life would be so much better organized. So let's go ahead and get started. This is the iPhone edition. Let's go. All right, Kurt here with Teach Mom How. Today I'm going to show you how to keep your inbox nice and organized by organizing your emails into categories. So these are called labels or folders. I like to call them folders, but Gmail calls them labels. So let me just give you the real world example. If you go out to your mailbox and you bring in a, a pile of 20 letters, you then have to go through those and organize them. You have to go through and go, okay, that's garbage, throw it away. Okay, that's for my husband, put it in my husband's box. Okay, that's for my wife, put it in my wife's box. That's for the kids, put it in their box. Does that make sense? You categorize these into folders or bins in the real world. This is the same thing, but in your digital email environment. You make labels, and let's say your boss emails you frequently, and a lot of times you need to refer back to those emails. So you don't want to delete them. You can put them all in a label or a folder for your boss. Or maybe you have a certain teacher at school who sends you emails and you need to be able to refer back to those emails for lessons and, and assignments. So rather than deleting them and, and also rather than just leaving them in your inbox and having it get cluttered, you throw them into a folder. Okay. So what you're going to do is you're going to set up these labels in whatever categories you want. What I actually do, let me show you my other inbox. I organize it into three main categories and you guys can decide how to do this. And unfortunately, Okay, so let me show you my labels in this account, okay? So what you're looking at is a bunch of labels. I have a lot of them, but they're all in three main categories. And I want to preface this by saying managing your labels or folders in Gmail is much easier on your computer, but I'm going to show you how to do it on your iPhone, so you can do that as well. So my life or my emails are categorized into three categories. Business is the main folder you'll see a, bu a business folder and then you see all these sub folders of business business 2007 business ADP business alarms business so on right you'll see all these sub folders my other my other main category is family so if I scroll down past all the business folders or the business labels I need to use the right term because Gmail uses them label or Gmail calls them labels you'll see church is one of my categories so anything that's involving my church, I keep in this folder or a subfolder of church. And then you'll see I have one for all my family stuff. So I have my main family category and then all my sub-family categories. Okay? You, may, you probably won't have that many. It's up to you how many you have. But the, what's nice about it on the computer is it doesn't show the entire list. It shows just the three main lists, and then you can open or close uh, the specific folders the specific labels so that you don't have to see all these all the time okay so that's mine let me go back over to where I have less labels just because it'll be easier to show you some examples so 
right here I've already made a few labels but let's say I want to make a new one I click create new label and name it whatever you're gonna name it and click done okay now if I go back to my label here it will show me everything that's in this category sorry I didn't want to open that it'll show me everything that's in this label now what you cannot do unfortunately on your phone is you cannot nest these labels as sub labels of a broader topic so like how I did in my other email account how I have business as a broad category and then I have a bunch of sub labels or sub folders within business you can't you, you can see them here but you cannot set that up within the, the iPhone app so you need to be on a computer to be able to set that up but you can create new labels okay so if you just go down to the bottom of labels and click create new that's where you would create a new label now let me show you how you keep your inbox super clean and tidy using these labels so let's come back to our primary emails we've got all these emails here okay so we can go through here and we can delete these by swiping to the right go back and watch the settings video to see how I set it up so that when I swipe right it deletes okay that's garbage that's garbage oh this is one that I want to save so what I'm going to do is I'm going to open this one this is one way to save this in one of your labels I'm going to click at the top right the three dots and I'm going to choose change labels and I'm going to put it in my test folder done go back okay that moved it to my test folder also if you watched my video on the Gmail settings I set mine up so that when I swipe right, it moves it to whatever label I tell it to. Okay, let's move it to test. And this is how I go through quickly and organize things on my iPhone. To be honest, I do this more on my computer because it's a lot faster. I can do it in bulk on my computer. But on your iPhone, this is how you do it. Oh, I want to delete this one. Swipe right. Oh, I want to save this one. Swipe left. Where do I want to put it? I want to put it in my work. Oh garbage swipe right garbage swipe right garbage swipe right garbage swipe right <laughs> garbage swipe right garbage swipe right oh this is one I want to save swipe left and put it in my work folder again if if you're not seeing the option when you swipe right to delete if you're seeing something else or when you swipe left to move it to a certain label then that's because you don't have your Gmail settings set up correctly. I'll put a link right here right now to try to remind you to go look at that video if I remember. If not, just go to the playlist that's at the end of this video under Gmail and you'll find the video on the Gmail settings and how to set that up so that when you swipe right, it deletes it and when you swipe left, it moves it to whatever label you chose to move it to. Okay. All right, so let's say you're tired of having to go one by one and delete these emails or move them into the appropriate label or folder. You can do this in bulk on your iPhone. Let me show you how to do that real quick. And it'll save you a lot of time if you're going through a lot of emails. So click on the hamburger, the three lines at the top left. Go down to the bottom and find settings. Under settings, click on conversation list density. Then click on compact. This will change your list so that they're more compact and you see more emails and you see a checkbox by each email. Click OK. Go back to your inbox. You'll see that you now see more emails and you see a checkbox by each email. So now I can go through and bulk delete or bulk organize different emails. So let's say I don't need this email. I don't need this. That I need. That's for work. This is garbage. This one's for work. I need it. Garbage, garbage, work, 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 garbage, garbage, garbage. Okay. So these ones I've selected are all garbage. I just click the trash can at the top, and that's going to bulk delete those. Now I go through and I put whatever ones are in work. Oh, this is a work email I need to save on. I need to save. This also I need to save. These ones are not work. This is work. This is work. This is work. Just This is just an example, okay? Now you can go through and bulk move all of those emails I selected into the work label. So I click the three dots at the top right and choose move to and then choose whichever label I want to move them to in this 
example its work. So that is how you can bulk organize all of your emails in your inbox into the appropriate labels or folders that you've created in your inbox. Hey, Kurt here with Teach Mom How. Before you go anywhere else, check out this playlist I created for you. Everything you can ever need or want to know about Gmail is found in this playlist. Click the video playlist and watch. Also, please like and subscribe to my channel and hit that bell for notifications.